So I'm there reading some comments on YouTube, obviously, and it was to an old 1984, I guess it was a scene from a movie, I guess, or it might have been a song they was all doing the original hip-hop or whatever, you know, the boom, 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 I don't fucking know. Uh, I was just, yeah, anyway. So the comments were like, well, and they weren't divided at all, so obviously it wasn't any agenda pushing anything, but, you know, I basically had to say, hey, just take it if it's that easy, you know? Like, like if you feel deserving of something that you feel, oh, you got you, you got misled into something and it became grew to be something that <laughs> something else, you know. Well, if that's the case, shit. And you and you feel like you got to make your own lane when it comes to rapping or stuff, or something like that, or change up your style or whatever, slow it down, speed it up. I don't know what you do out there. Definitely ain't studying no dictionary. We threw all them motherfuckers in the, wherever we tossed them out at. Well, then why don't you just start doing, not not being envious of the of the mind reading tactic, tactics out there, not, not not wanting a sense of belonging because you got to suck gooch, gooch rock, moose drop juice box for that shit. And you know, only the, the best deserve that. Behind closed doors, which I'll never get that. So basically I'm saying, what if, what if you change lyrics to songs up to basically be like, you rapped about things that you didn't wish for, and you didn't wish bad on them, it was just straight words, straight statements. Even, I don't know, maybe you can use questions. Uh, yeah, questions, I guess, would be a good one. You know, like, you know, what if you interrupted, like, I don't know, I'm just going off the top here. What if you interrupted me while I was spitting right now? And then a, and it, and then a sparrow came out of the sky and did a swan dive and landed in your front yard. And, and I don't know. <laughs> and then it just started happening, you know. Nor do I want to be mentally, like, man, that would suck, wouldn't it, as an artist? If you if you got mentally attacked in your own mental from the outside source and you were on stage and you were performing doing your own thing trying to get money for whoever or you know make a way for whoever and you know I don't I, I don't ever want it I didn't ever get into hip hop nor do I ever want to be in it as a means of oh I, I got shit to make up or or someone wants me to hurry up and get and cash out and so they so they can get their cut. You know, they know, they know the type of person I am. They know the promises, the broken ones, and the ones I kept. <laughs> you know, I didn't ever try to break your goddamn promise. Shit, if I told you I was gonna give you some money because you listened to me coming up. Hell, do what I told you. Hit the mailbox up. <laughs> Send me a letter. Send me a picture of you. Spark that memory that me and you had. I mean, shit. I, there's a lot of people in my hometown that I, I I said I'm gonna cut a big check for you. Everybody else just has to get twenty dollar bills. I'm sorry. You gotta catch me when I'm coming and going, but. You know, anyway, just thoughts for the day.